Good morning and welcome back. As promised, I am joined by the lovely Erin Young of Red Buffalo Coffee and Tea. Good morning. Good morning. Cheers. Cheers. Good to see you. You too. Um, I just love it when Erin comes on because she brings me delicious Every caffeinated treats. And warm things too. <laughs> yes. You warm. Your hands around yeah, it. exactly. Cuddle it. Um, I love what you brought me today. This yes. is like, you guys have, first off, Local coffee shops, you gotta love them. Thank they're you. The, they're the bleeding, or not bleeding, beating hearts. Beating heart. We beating bleeding, heart. you know, you know we'll, we'll, we'll wear our heart on our sleeve for you too. <laughs> but they're the beating heart of the community, you know, it's a hub. Thank you. And you guys do specialty coffees. Yes. Um, my mother is obsessed with your espresso. Oh, I'm so glad she is. You can, you can actually, you can purchase all of Aaron's um, coffee and teas there instead you know if you want to purchase them in bulk which and we have to ship do for them my out mom, or whatever it is but which I do for my mother because she's obsessed with your espresso well that's a good thing <laughs> there, there are worse vices there this is very true so today what am I drinking you have a honey brown sugar latte made with almond milk oh and you know we always do we have three espresso grinders that we can use on our espresso machine and espresso here's your random fact it isn't doesn't have to be a specific as less espresso roast hmm. um, it, you can make any coffee bean. Espresso is simply just a matter of um, the the extraction process. It's a concentrated coffee, and so we have our Indeed. standard. We have our standard <laughs> roast that we go through. It's our Magic Mesa blend, and that's mm -hmm. a, a mix of a um, that's a Mexican and Ethiopian and a Guatemalan roast, uh, or sorry, um, estate beans. And then we also have our single origin grinder. And today on the grinder, we have this really good Guatemalan. It's incredibly bright okay. and kind of acidic and mm -hmm. has these really good citrus notes. And But that one changes, the single estate grinder. So oh. yesterday I had our Colombian on it. This weekend we had our Sumatra on it. And it's fun if you're drinking straight espresso or Americanos or something, you're really going to notice that difference. Difference, right. And, okay. you know, our staff has a lot of fun with it too. So with the, uh, the Magic Mesa blend that we have, one of our staff girls this weekend, she was really playing with mixing other elements in there as you extract the, oh. the coffee through the espresso machine. So she added some of our very berry tea, which complements the notes of the Ethiopian so well, because the Ethiopian's a natural process, has a lot of cherry notes just oh, in it. Oh, so it enhances it. It enhances it. So we have so much fun playing with these drink combinations and having a good time. So if you want to come in and have a moment to sit and relax, that's the best way to enjoy a good cup of coffee or a good cup of tea. It's just to, you know, take two extra minutes, even if you have to go on the road. It's Two true. extra minutes, take a sip without a lid on, because your nose plays half of the part of taste. Oh, that makes sense. And if you put a lid sense. on it, mm -hmm. you, you know, the, it's, yeah, you, don't, you can't smell it. You can't it. smell it. Oh, that's a very good point. So when you can, take a couple sips without the uh, the lid on, or better yet, get it in a ceramic cup. Enjoy our atmosphere. Have a good time. Well, and it is a really lovely atmosphere Thank over there. You. I love it year round. I often will go there to get some work done. You can get on the Wi-Fi, mm -hmm. um, but it's a really it's a it's a nice environment for meetings to get work done or to catch up with some friends. And I have to say too, in the spring and the summertime, I love your back porch. It's You've wonderful. Beautiful back porch right on the river. And you know what? The we still have people who sit on the the bench that's literally right like in the in the springtime when the water sides in the water. But people still sit there throughout the winter because you can see people fly fishing because yes, people fly fish in zero degree weather. I don't understand it. Good for them. But our we neighbors, can watch them. Our neighbors are cutthroat anglers and they are happy to set people up. We have <laughs> We have such a great local community vibe just right in our center that we're just happy to have people come in. And it's right in Silverthorne. It's so central to everything, just a it quarter is. mile off the I-70 Silverthorne mm -hmm. interstate exit. Okay. It brings you into town. You're right next to the rec center, the factory stores, the Summit Stage Transfer Station if you want to, you know, your oh, free transportation. Right. Good to know. Yeah. Well, very easily located, centrally located, yes. and you often offer um, free live entertainment on the weekends. Um, yep, on the weekends. So our Facebook page, what we always try to propagate with, that information. Mm -hmm. um, and of course, if you want to get a grab and go sandwich or a lunch, if you're headed up on the hill and you want to bring some lunch with you or you're going backcountry skiing, we have some great food options to bring with you. I feel like Red Buffalo is pretty much a staple for all of my friends, for myself and my friends. It's like, okay, where are we going to meet up? We always meet up at Red We're Buffalo. We're a meeting point. It's, it's a hub. Yeah, you are. And it's like, oh, we need a drink to go yes. to start our day. Of we need you a do. snack. It's, it's very important. Yes. It's, and when you say, I want to grab a coffee, that's really just the expression, but you can get so much more. And even if you're not a coffee drinker, you still use that expression to 
to meet people or if you're going to have a meeting you know we have these large community tables that you know you can you know, meet your someone else working on their laptop because right. we joke that people should just put our address on their business cards because mm -hmm. a lot of people just do all their business there mm -hmm. or you know we have large family groups or town of silverthorne or knitting clubs whatever it is you can really just get to know silverthorne by yep. coming to your local shop it's true well and that is uh, oh and you can see some photos of this right yeah. now but it's the truth and i um i'm not a huge coffee drinker myself every now and then when i need it it's delicious but and I love it, but I really love your teas. You kind of hand pick and hand select all of your teas. We do. And we have some really good ones that are great on like a, when you have a winter cold because mm -hmm. a lot of people are starting to hit that sort of, uh, you feel congested. Winter sort of, lull colds. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so we have some great options. We have the strawberry sassafras white tea. It's got echinacea and licorice and some other really good, and it's just got this good spice that's really nice with Ooh. some honey or agave. See, Erin takes good care of everybody yeah, here. You're like the community, the community mom in a way. I tr I try. You know, it's funny. I am, and I try not to be like that mom figure. But my staff <laughs> has just taken to calling me mom, even the ones who are older than me. I know the feeling. It's yeah. a compliment. It is. Yeah. <laughs> I cook them. I bake them cookies, and I bring cookies into the staff. And you know, we're just a family there. And you come in, and you're part of our family. It's very true, and you need to experience this for yourself. So, do make sure to make some time. Come in. You can chat with the lovely and talented Erin Young and her staff at Red Buffalo Coffee and Tea. And like Erin was saying, located very conveniently right off of I-70, just yes. like I said, a quarter mile. Quarter mile north, just 358 Blue River Parkway. There we go. Well, thank you so much for joining Thanks me. For and thank you for today. my delicious brown sugar You're latte. Welcome. You guys have got to try this. Or also, I love the Nutty Professor latte. It's one of our signatures, yep. Truth. <laughs> well, thanks so much for joining me. Thanks for me. having me today. Folks, we'll be right back with more Summit Sunrise right after this.